I do it, they're like, mm, eat the piece, like that, boom, boom, boom. How I do it is, you know, like, I sometimes I'll start out with the beats first, you know what I'm saying? And then I'll um, have someone come in, sit on it, like, you know, on some vocals or whatever, and then I arrange the, the, the music around what he has, what he or she is saying. We're here at Okrin's Shield. We're gonna take out the other hand man of the Holy Phoenix. So I'm pretty sure Valentina is in this Y house. I don't think he's in any of these smaller places. I mean, he definitely could. You can probably just kick over this entire place considering while I was recording the B-roll for the beginning of this, this skimmer took out a bunch of people. And also this tech hunter guy is about to walk in there too. After he he literally went in, killed a bunch of people, and then uh, when he went down, I sent Greed in there to pick him up, healed him, and now he's he's literally just on his way, walking back in there again. So I guess we'll see what he does. But yeah, we're gonna go take out Valentina. I don't think it should be harder than Seda at all, since it's new in a city. I mean, like it's a fortress, so I guess it should be harder. Now, just like before, to get past the harpoon guns, just to run all the way through. And we're gonna sit outside this guy's building. Heal for a second. Might as well see what's in this building. Uh, it's just a storehouse. A lot of booze barrels. Anyways. Take out these guys. Well, okay, let's just barge in here. It's only called Barracks, but I'm pretty sure this is where Valentina's gonna be. Just because it's the biggest building. Paladin, 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 Paladin. Inquisitor, Paladin. Hello? Okay, I can't see what that guy is. Can't see what that guy is. Inquisitor. Oh, okay. Inquisitor. Hi, Inquisitor Valentina. Okay. I mean, he's sleeping. So that's ideal, I guess. We should probably go outside for the outdoors penalty. Unless they're just not gonna fall off. Okay, yeah, they're coming outside. Eh, yeah, lust could be inside, whatever. That is a lot of red. A hundred, wait. Valentina, what are your stats? 70s and 80s. That's kind of annoying. I think pride's fighting you. <laughs> and sloth. Jesus, that's, this man has big hits. Jesus, hitting pride for four for like seventies and stuff. God damn, okay, well pride's down. How's everyone else doing? Gluttony is fighting an Inquisitor. Greed and Lust and Wrath are all fighting another Inquisitor. Yeah, I mean everyone else is I mean they're pretty hurt. Okay, Wrath, instead of fighting them, blew yourself up. Envy is just getting hit while she's down. I think the rest of them have the other two Inquisitors, but Valentina's definitely gonna be a tough cookie. Let's pick up Envy, get her away from Valentina, put her down, then you just heal Envy up just to make sure she's loads. Loth is holding his own, okay, eh, he gets hit in the chest or stomach one or two more times and he's down. Now Lust is down. Is this guy even low? Eh, not really. He's only hitting for 8. What is Pride doing? Oh, he didn't even heal himself. He just went to another battle. Reed's fighting Valentina now. Valentina's not even hurt that much. Okay, now Wrath is just getting hit around. Jesus. Sloth, what are you doing? Why... Why do these guys choose to not, like, heal before they start getting into battles? Ah, god damn it. Okay. Yeah, this one's not turning out super well. No siree. What's Valentino looking like? Where is he? Right here. Not hurt, like, at all. Have Wrath just heal himself up so he's not super low. God 
god, Greed, why are you so low, dude? Try to heal yourself before you do anything. Yeah, Wrath can take out this one regular paladin. Okay, he's down. Who needs healing the most? Lust is very low, okay. Heal her first. Gluttony will make it. It's pretty banged up, but he's not really the worst. Sloth's pretty messed up. Envy will be fine. Everyone's outside, which is good, considering I'm pretty sure Valentina's still inside. Well, no one's coming out to attack us, so really we could just sit out here for a little bit and heal up. Or I guess fight this guy again. Like the third time, is that just a regular paladin? Okay, Gluttony, before this guy gets up again, his weapon <laughs> is always a lot more useless. Take his helmet too, and his boots, and his shirt, and his pants too, so he's embarrassed. Since that first assault didn't go too hot, and almost all the sins are near death, uh, I'm gonna call in for backup. So we're taking in some of the top boys. Agnew, Beep, Rain the Giant, Chad, Ruka, Squint, Fu, and Kang. So all of our people that are either cool like Beep and Agnew, or just people that have high stats that are like in the 40s. Like uh, our original boys that we were hanging out with a lot. So we're gonna send them over to Okrin's Shield because Valentina apparently is kind of a badass. So we're gonna get some backup. Well, honestly, the Sins are just standing right outside of this place. And also, I think a bunch of tech hunters and like spiders and stuff showed up and they're kind of destroying the rest of the place. Cloud ninjas here? Interesting. Some more cloud ninjas walked up. Attack hunter robot. Pretty sure there's two or three of them in here. There's some dead spiders like this one that's on the wall. While we're taking out Valentina, just random NPCs keep walking into this fort and they're kind of destroying everyone else. So we'll see how they do. We're just gonna wait for our reinforcements to cross the map and they're in the hub right now but yeah we're just gonna wait for them to show up and then we'll attack Valentina again I guess there should be like 14 or 15 of us in total once they get here and there are still just damage numbers flying everywhere over on the other side of the base okay the reinforcements are just coming up onto Oakland's shield and I made them a new group called Camelot so they're gonna go and help the seven sin. Okay, we kind of just ran in and no one really cared. So basically all the sins are like full health almost now, but it did take like two days. Now we have, we have 16 people that are about to fight Valentina and the two or three inquisitors that are in here. Get them to actually come out, have them back up a little bit. The Darken can only be destroyed by the flame. It was a persistent thing. Okay, everyone just attack Valentina. I guess if he's the only person that's gonna come out. They attack all, so they attack the other guy. That's not really what I meant by attack all, but whatever. Let's just keep watching Valentina. It looks like all the shitty people are up fighting him, and Chad just missed a kick. Honestly, if the shitty people kind of just keep him occupied while the better people are fighting, like the other Inquisitors, I don't really mind that that much. See yeah, how Valentina's doing over here. This is probably the lowest we've gotten him, and these aren't even the best guys fighting him yet. He is cutting down people though, which is kind of annoying. Okay, everyone else be a medic. Everyone else can just keep fighting him, I guess. What's health looking like? I mean, his chest is getting pretty low. Pretty sure 
what are the sins looking like? The ones that are still up are doing pretty okay. Okay, Breath just got hit in the face for a hundred. But still, not that bad. Seda's chest is at 37. And now, who is this? A mercenary captain? Really? Now we're gonna be enemies with the mercenary guild because freaking this random captain just showed up. Prisoner got back up. Chad. Wait, did the Inquisitor just fall down right there? Ooh, we got the Inquisitor. Okay, Chad, heal yourself. Pride. Yeah, get that last hit in, bro. He has an edge type 2 Paladin's Cross. That's good, but it's not like Mei Tao, you know what I'm saying? Okay, pick him up. Kidnap Valentina. Okay, we, we got what we're coming for. None of the sins died. Uh, did Camelot die? We had nine, right? Okay, yeah, so all of Camelot survived. Probably just bare- Yeah, chest of negative 70 on Pedro. Yikes. Negative 94 on Agnew's chest. That's... not good. You guys should probably repair that first. Okay, so we got the guy we came for. I mean, granted, the Sins definitely couldn't take him on by themselves. That's why we got the Sinners and Camelot and stuff. So, I mean, still got the job done. Now we just need to head back to Admag with Valentina, and then we can take on Blister Hill. And then that's it. We'll have taken out the Holy Phoenix. Okay, we've carried them all the way to Admag. Time to turn Valentina into the Stone Golem, and then we'll be on our final journey. Wait, did they? They kept Seda in the cell? Okay, cool, cool. Hopefully they put Valentina right next to him after we find what's-his-face that I have to talk to. Buy in, yep. Valentina of the East. I hand him over. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I should have expected none less from the famous Battleborn. Honored Legendary Pride. Okay, he's not gonna go next to Seda. He's gonna go on the roof. Baking the sun a little bit. Okay, Stone Bomb, what's up? Valentina is defeated, and the Holy Nation is in a panic. Loathsome. So gutless are the flat skins. Okay. Hmm. Forgiveness, Kin. Not you. But the Phoenix still holds his forces. He must die. Okay, cool. Take out the Phoenix next. And then the Holy Nation will be no more. 